lunch break. Council, can we continue, please? If you are ready, please we'll proceed. You should ask for some money from uh, <coughs> <coughs> Welcome back, Mr. Witness. Uh, Thank you. Uh, I remind you that you are on the oath. Uh, and uh, you have an obligation to speak the truth. You have a right not to incriminate yourself. But you do not have a right to speak on truth. You don't have a right to provide false or misleading information. You understand? Before the break, the lunch break, we agreed, we established that uh, men in black would bring up as the suspects already tortured before the commission and their statements were taken. Correct. Um, bringing them does not go straight to statements taking. They are brought in and we interview the statements are taken. You are correct in that. They were brought in, already tortured, and presented to the panel to be interviewed. Correct? I agree that some of them were tortured, yes. Before the break, we have also agreed, you have also agreed, uh, that uh, members of the panel knew that these people who were brought, some of them were tortured. Before the break, we were talking about the interview environment. Uh, you have said that those who brought in the suspects wore black black and 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 face and, and masks uh, or balaclavas as some would call them uh, they had weapons which was intimidating Yes. The last point we dealt with before the break was whether inside the panel, inside the room, 
whether that environment was also intimidating. That's the point we were discussing. So let me now ask the question again. You said the, in the interview environment, the room where the interrogations were going on was tense. So I ask you again whether that environment was fearful or was it intimidating? That was my feeling and I believe others also feel the same. In that basis, I can, can we conclude that the environment too was fearful, it was intimidating. <laughs> That was my feeling, yes, Councillor. Uh, we have uh, received testimonies from uh, members of the panel or the, the statement takers. Uh, we have received testimony from, from the uh, victims. All of them say the environment was intimidating even for even for the investigators themselves. They may be right because I was intimidated as an individual. You know, why? In that environment, which was, which you said was intimidating to you, do you think that on the basis of, your, of the legal knowledge you have, do you think that that environment was a suitable environment to interview a suspect and obtain a confession? Where and how am I here? Do I own no no I don't know no who be me. Well, what be seen and acted on better than what be ten kata. Johnny, she could have no 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 you put a dad on net no one that I've been born in Puma. Put on Lambomo and there on Dula, Hapara, on Heba Congo, in Jungo Mako. She could have been known no yardy allowal, no footy yardy me. It may not be, but there was no other option, Council. You know, I've gone on a fair go allowed on Council. The issue I have with your answer is the use of the word may. It may not be. But we have no other choice. That's what you said. No, no, I didn't say that, Council. C repeat your answer then. I said it may be, but we have no other choice. <laughs> well, if it may be, it also may not be. But I'll take what you just said. Okay? It may be, but we have no other choice. Uh, this is no like borderline situation. It is either the environment was not a suitable environment for an interview because of the illegalities, or it was. It cannot be in between. I ask you the question again. 
in view of the intimidating and fearful environment which you also felt as an investigator, do you think, in view of your legal training, that it was a conducive environment to conduct an interview lawfully? Sangari don kero ni wawata ato ni wende kuhunde wotere e wawata wende. Don ndender sudundu no wawano don wairi alwari mawira e don wapi si nati don perle mape ten katano hulpili. So joni sikuda don non kudula muandu da no moji puru be lambda neto wala be adato neto be wala mu interview wala be lambda mo puru hebo nkongu ujuru mako wairi onon hayon onon wombe nder don anhore ma wira don dal e wela nani manu piji dini wumiri don sikuda don no moji nula iliadi elawol legale no si andari esango luwa kwa kwa wanga don yadani therefore Therefore, for flowing from what you have said, any interview conducted in such an environment and a confession obtained, what should be the legal consequences of that statement, of that confession? Jolly, sit down at the Adam alone. No PGD no an hore ma year an hajo no only me. Si got no Adam alone. And then on jama the lambdimo. Hajoni o hali hala jimwandu dabe bangi dum hapari. Esembo lua o joni on hala mako ono uliri. E lua ono waluri. Sikula ono no no mwenye wala no yadi e lua wala kono wai. It could be good ground for involuntary confession. Nung kodara nande fonda wande kelu nande. I said it could be good ground for involuntary confession. Nung kodara nande fonda Fundamental mood with the poor on the Uganda that I want them a poor or our job with the Congo quarter of them. And by involuntary confession, you mean a confession that is illegally obtained? Oh no no no! Kufiriti kodi mo si hala heba madon e jumbo netlo. On hala wawa wande wona hala muamuda no 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 labi wala ya dani elawol. That is, that it was If it is not voluntary, then it is illegally obtained. If that's your direction, I agree. We are talking about law here. It's not about my own perception. It has to be voluntary. If it is not voluntary, it is illegal. Do you agree with that? If it is not voluntary, it is involuntary, and it could be set aside when it is interpreted somewhere. Uh, are you avoiding to say the word illegal? I, um, the, law, the law says a confession should be obtained voluntarily. If it is not obtained voluntarily, that confession is illegally obtained and therefore should be set aside. That is the law. Do you agree with that? Don't interpret this. I don't contest law. If that is the law, that is the law. It is not a question of if. Do you agree that that is the law? Answer, I think, uh, I don't disagree from this. Uh, the, 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 okay, the, just say it then. Just, just say it then. If you I said involuntary. If it is involuntary, obviously, it, is, it, it, it has some issues. And that's what I said. If, if it is involuntary, it, it could be set aside. So illegally, uh, when it is illegal too, I, I will contest that. 
Because that's, that's what you say. So, so you agree that if it is not voluntarily given, it is illegally obtained? You agree with Yes, it? Counsel. Was this known to the panel that what they were doing was obtaining illegal confessions? Johnny, the one in that panel, or come before the map, the Andununa, the Halalaji, come here, what be in that Jude, the Yim, Yadani, Elawal. I cannot remember telling any of the statement writers that this were illegally obtained. Oh, wow, what I'm I didn't tell them anything like that. Because I was the 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 head of the police panel, uh, investigators. So obviously that directive possibly may come from me or the other person else, but I didn't tell them not to obtain statements. You are what I'm wondering. I wonder when Mihala need a window. No, we get to be here. Hala Jima Beni we got the wonder ma. Hala Jima Beni the one get you a journey running. The Adani El El Luau. You are what I'm wondering. We want to know from police that because me John for no journey that Niya Miroji the window be there. Coming for no be journey. Look on me. Me man it again. Don't. My question was not meant to elicit that answer. My question was, was it known to the members of the panel that there were these illegalities ongoing? There was this environment uh, which made it such that confessions that were obtained would be lawfully obtained. And unlawfully obtained. And their panel or what they want, they yield the room, and their panel or come the coin map. The Andunona, Gonga Gonga, Halalaji, Kuman, Bangatai, Jude, the Yimbe, Sita, Halo, the D Halaji, Kovieta, Kurumuni, Halamap, or a statement map, or Kuman Bangako, Sita, and then on Sudu, where it on Hajo only Robin Huli, the Humpini. So Johnny is on Bangi Hala, a Jude, what they end up on. Kudum Milan di Sita Dunul on Halamo Banya Jude Mape. Wari Dula on Hulbina, so don't know why we want the Kulua Ovi on Sifa Hala before you do in the Sango. I am so with the police panelists they should know. Me. The rest, I, the appreciation may be different. So the holy one the men and song on the man in one of the police event. He be handicapped. So, you telling the commission that you, the police officers in the panel, you were sure that what was going on was unlawful and the statements obtained would have been, the confessions obtained would have been unlawfully obtained. So That's what you said, right? Johnny Kurida, Ko, Kohalanda, Commission of Kudumuni. On Sengo Police Abe, on Andy, or no Yaratani, Hala Kobe Bangata Jude Bay Yimbe, a wiry Bay Dula on the Hulbini, Hala Ka, Wawata won the Hala Wanda or Darat, a Noodal Kudum Halan Tap Commission or Darnedi, or on Sengo Police Abe, on Andu Nodum. You state this obtain under any form of duress. Would have issues when it gets to the courts. But you know. But then, Andy wonder must see. I get the hala. You stay in school, and we have to go by what the rules is. Well, but then, Andy wonder must see. I get the hala. You go under the water. Nama himo itaka a two mal. The kang hala kahibuda. You go under the two mal. Ko what mo jet chenda on hala makoy. You go ma ko hari mo ko ibite jetu da bo kang hala. Si o yehi kasuru nyawa or kang don kang hala katake te sengo. Well, it's the status quo that we are trying to find out. We are trying to establish what the status quo was. Uh, so you accept that the police component of the investigations, you knew that there were these illegalities going on and you knew that those statements, those confessions that were obtained during these illegalities are tainted and therefore they were illegally obtained. You knew that. Correct. So Johnny Luano and Horema Sengo Police on Andi Hala Kobe Bangye Jude Be Yimbe Wairi Gonga Gonga Wana 
wana halaji mandu da ko be yinge yimbe tigi tigi welti ha be hali din halaji kono non no be okkiri halaji din e on dula do be woni don no walu dal be min e hulbi ni be min be min huli telon wana dal belde mabbe pour be hala don non no walu hala ko be on jure mabbe don on hala wawata darade wawata wonde hala mandu da goddo yadade en hala I knew the, those statements could be subjected to some rejection somewhere. But again, that is not the question I asked. Mm -hmm. not whether the statements would be subjected to some rejection somewhere. That is not the question. We are now in Halaji, we are not in Halaji, we are not in Halaji. The question is, you said earlier that the police knew that due to these illegalities, the confessions were unlawfully obtained. Okay. Uh, so uh, yes, I said they were obtained under duress, which is not right. That, which, that's what I said. And the police, you said, knew that. Tell on a uh, police, single police can be and you know. And so that was obvious. The police knew. Good. Uh, the information we received from other members of the panel. Is also that they knew. But but let me ask this question. As the police in the panel responsible for taking statements and so forth, did you advise the panel that what they were doing was unlawful? Why the police have a one in their panel on? Come the hit Andy. So Johnny, on what any fair pro on Okayamiro or Purpedo, Pur Camp a Calabe Anda, Gonga Gonga Ligue Commun, Ligue Commun, the member of the Sadumi, Yad Anela or Ho on Yamir on Okan on Yamiro. They are not cancelled. I didn't. Allah cancelled them. You did not. Is that what you said? But you knew that this thing was ongoing, it was illegal, you just decided to go along with it, correct? Johnny Nwano Dal, Onon Police Abbe, On Andy Ko Watte Ni, Wona La Wol, Wona Ni Be Pijidin Foti Yarude, On Andy Um, Kono On Yerni, On Ati, Haju On, Kono Kondini. Yes, Council. Hey, Council. And do you realize that by doing that, uh, you have really failed to do what you are supposed to have done as a police officer? I don't know why the colon has been had on Yari. Our journey on on what any league we are under, our own own fault no own fault no what the assembly police no be forty what did the sita halaka yari no no one would all on what any own fault no what the on that the on the one on on. What I was doing at the time was what I could have done. The only thing I could have done. What I know from on jama no could not do. We know what the on what to do. We would come to that later. The question is, by not doing anything about it, you have failed to do what you were expected or required to do 
by law as a police officer. Our journey on a chila wall, Mwanduda ko on la wall on foot no bande, wala on wadani ligge, Mwanduda ko non on foot no wade, on a chi ligge en foot no yarude. Sengo police have a journey police on could be for what they do. I want to know what I need to get up. I don't want to agree with that. I I I talk I I I of the view that what we did in getting their statements, regardless of the fact that it was on a bad environment, was to try to help them out to get the truth from them and and then state it as they stated it, even though. It may not be voluntary. Si kani mwa wa jambo inducement. So mena ngoenda mena kuwalu gol bata hiya wa gol hebu gol kongu le jumba mbe. That was why. Are you really serious, Mr. Witness? Are you really serious with that answer? Onde ko ko kuhalda kono gonga 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 kodo oni berima. If we think here that you are not speaking the truth, if we think so, and we take you out and beat you to help you. Speak the truth. Would that be lawful? Jolly no, Kawanda don. Sita a hali mina wombe domain sfiku. Eh, wana gonga halta ni. Jolly wop the yana edoma, the nangama, the nabama yasi, the lipoema. Sikula no yadi elaol. And no? Allah. Why would you therefore think that what you did was okay because you just helped them to speak the truth? Jadi, saya kau tu baru mula inon kita kuat on kon tanah Allah yang wajar kon walau inon pen rek pul bawa hal de ko gonga ko berfot no hal de. I'm not so where your scenario is what had happened to everybody who came before the panel. No, we just can't misal kon da kon gender do kon misal be arbe be yeso panel on foko da misal kon. We just looking at what you said. And Johnny, can come on Lara erect and co halt a co co dum and Lara and Johnny. You said yes, there was some jurors, but all we did was we just helped them speak the truth, regardless of the things that may have happened. Mila, go 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 when I could have not yes or no yes that's what I said but, yes. but this is what I'm saying that this is very sad that's to come from a senior police officer there was jurors there is torture and you said it was okay all we did was help them uh, state the truth that they were going to say. That is that is that is that is serious. That is that is a fundamental violation of the constitution of this country. Are you aware of that? They are the men, the lipid men, the lipid men. Kolonon wira ko onon ko nwalai no ben rekpu on heba hala ejude mape. Kolonon gonga 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 kolon sikuda kolonon ni laol kolonon ni laol kolonon ya di laol. I think also sometimes we go around my statement and construct a sentence as if though that's what I said. Sikie council and what would you go? I have a big a big. I'm serious. I have never said that land of Dalai Lama was here long ago. What has happened was 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 lawful. No, I didn't say that. But I said the condition under which we were operating. That's what I said. Don't don't interpret this. Let's go, Mr. Witness. I just told you what you said. You said you agreed. That's what you said. I told you that that is very sad. What you said is a fundamental violation of the constitutional rights yes, of those you, people. You, you continue to say some other things too. That is why I'm reacting. But when I confirm to have said, yes, I did say that. Okay, let's put it back this way. You said, uh, yes, there was duress. Okay, and other things have happened. But all we did was to help them uh, to say the truth that they were going to say anyway. That's what you said. True or false? Yes, that's what I said. I'm telling you again, mm -hmm. the third time, that is, it's like you completely disregard the provisions of the Constitution. There should be no duress. There should be no torture. So to say that it is okay, we just help them 
to confess. That is very sad. And it is this mindset, the fact that you can just sit here and say, we just help them to make the confession, which suggests that to you, this was okay. But it is not okay. I wish this was the opportunity we had at that time. It would have been a different thing. So, no, but even now, so, so, even now, Mr. Witness, you see it as okay. No, what All you did was help them to make the confession. So, so you torture them, and then you just help them to make the confession, and it's fine. But if that has what had happened to you, it would not be fine, would it? I I never said it's fine. I never said the tortures were fine, counsel. I didn't say that. And that is why I say sometimes we go around my sentence and create a sentence and give the impression that that's what I said. Oh, I didn't say that their beating, their tortures was right. I didn't say that. But I said that one cannot be held and you have to enjoy it. That's what, what, what the reality was. But that is what I don't agree with. Well, that was the reality. Whether you agree or not, that is for the council to take, take it. That is, that is was the reality. Uh, uh, Mr. Witness, you you huffing and puffing at the same time. You say something, you accept that you said it, then you turn around and you say you did not say it. But I would leave that issue and I move on. Do you think that what happened was right? I Well, uh, what happened was right. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, that cannot be right. Are you proud of it as a police officer? No, I cannot be proud of that. Are you disappointed with all of you? No, no. I would not call it disappointed. I, I wouldn't call it that. It was wrong, yes. But then the, the circumstances were such that what do you do? If there, was a, if there was an option, yes. But if no option, we'll do what, what the, the, the possibilities are out. Mr. Witness, you sit here, you said you saw the illegalities going on. You would not even tell your colleagues that this was illegal. Yes, I wouldn't tell them. That does not but isn't that a failure? of your duty. You are a police officer. A violation of a right is here happening right in front of you. Yes. It was criminal. Take it to be a failure, can't you? No. Tell us. You tell the commission. It was a failure. You tell the commission. You want to take it as anything. You tell the commission. You failed in your duties. I had no choice. But you failed. If I failed, I had no choice. But do you first agree that you have failed? I agree I agree that there was a responsibility that I have that I could have brought, but I, I didn't do it. It was as a result of the circumstances. And that is failure on your part to do what you were professionally obliged to do. I will still say yes, but uh, uh, qualified by the circumstances. What were the circumstances? Well, except if you want me to repeat myself, I said the characters within that environment, the environment was terrible, intimidating, fearful. So what, what else? Those were the circumstances. You could have told them that you were not to give a statement. You were not the person being investigated. 
Okay. What, what were the circumstances that compelled you to close your eyes to these illegalities that were ongoing? When I am footy or could a halaji manu da bangadum, when I am the lambdoto, Colonel Kunumadi Hajoni, a Japani lad that we get a madden, a single Piji Mandu Adimia Dani, a lawal, Mandu da, we know only in the league combat on Kunumadum. Well, can't you let me to say that this, uh, this, it, 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 the situation was tense, it was fearful, it was intimidating. So, and that is to the, everybody, that, that was what we are discussing here. So, if, well, if you are you, trying to you, get you, me out of that now, no, no, I no, want no, me no. to say something different. No, 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 no. no. Well, you, well, you were, in fact, you, you, you well, could, you, could you listen to one another? You were, in fact, avoiding saying that was to everybody. But you have accepted that now. We are very happy that you have done so. But the question is, for you, apart from the existence of these characters around, what was it that compelled you to saw the illegalities and you just closed your eyes to them as if they did not exist? What was it? There was no exceptional circumstance apart from what the realities were on the ground. In that venue. That was the same only circumstance. I don't understand. If I'm there were well, no well, exceptional well, circumstances outside, except the realities uh, uh, on the outside, ground. Outside what obtains in that room. Yes. When That's what I'm saying. Yes. Yes. The room yes. is what yes. was the determiner. Yes. So, the so, so what, what was it? What was it that compelled you to close your eyes to what was happening? Closing eyes in, the, in, in, in trying to draw the attention was like you, you never know what the repercussion would be, so you don't venture. Did you members of the panel discuss it? Discuss what? Like to see the situation? No, I have obtained within the panel. That, that I think can be here. If 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 my memory serves me right, if if go past that, I you want to come back again. Just answer the question. We've all felt intimidated. Thank you for for accepting that, uh, even though it's two hours late. But the question is, did you discuss? what was going on at the panel that these were illegalities? Did you discuss them? Yes, we discussed. What I can recall while was the presence of these other characters that we discussed. Uh, yes, uh, 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 yes, I don't remember that. Did, did you discuss that tortures were ongoing? On the other hand, 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 on Yes, we discussed myself. I had right. I'm so yes, And did you decide to just go along with the situation? So, Johnny, on Larry Dal, ah, no, they fadu me yada eko wate ni rek me yada idum. There was no suggestion of going otherwise. <laughs> there was just in a lot of expressive what the feeling was, but <laughs> not to think otherwise. Major Arani, I'm a poor man, but it's a affair on a single go. So by continuing, by continuing and by going along, you have accepted to participate in an unlawful enterprise. Where on Jami, pull on Yada, a Hajjo, no worry at all. 
on jabi e fiji dum no walori don awa joni e no wawno dal on non kala on jabi pour on e wada haaju fi e goddo mon da yada ne lawol enterprise i don't understand but I, what i know is no okay way. call it engagement well, an unlawful engagement you carried out an unlawful activity which was obtaining confessions from people under circumstances which render it illegal no no rek eh ma waya wide pour bangol kongol jude yimbe manduda no banuri bin halaje jude mabbe yadani e lawol so joni joni ko dum men haltani eh don non si si ta jabbi ko non wonirina like i said earlier this was also mentioned i will repeat it again because we said anything that has to do with law if it was lawful or unlawful uh, i cannot contest that in hali no bawo no eh wanda ma kala ko adama wadi bade dan na ma wanda ma yadan e lawol te luwa jaban dum dum mi important dirta dum do why don't you just answer the question yes or no aba wa bi dare ha wala hani i think i need to explain to, to, to explain so that you also it is not be a matter of you making the statement and i am saying yes to it it is me who is making the statement can you uh, mr witness this is the art of cross examination the cross examiner puts the proposition for the witness to adopt the proper cross examiner does not make statements oh is that so Well, you don't need to make my statement. I am here that this is not even if you are cross examining me counsel. I think you also need to appreciate the fact that I am the one who is testifying. Oh, Mr. Witness, okay, let's not argue over the mistakes. Please just answer the question. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah, right? Jalan won put on dira. Joni non what what affair? Uh, don't interpret this it's just a repetition i have okay. to break down the questions take the baby steps and arrive okay you knew the illegalities were going on correct correct answer the illegalities on statement record is that the, the the tortures the jurors the 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 intimidating and fearful environment you know that was existing yes yes counsel and you knew that under such circumstances to obtain a confession would be unlawful correct yes uh you close your eyes to all those facts correct yes you went along and took the statements correct yes knowing fully well that the circumstances were not the ones under which a statement could lawfully be taken correct yes So in effect you agree therefore that you participated in an exercise that was unlawful correct no i wouldn't agree that i i participated because in an unlawful exercise as you put it um but but are you allowed by law to take to obtain a confession unlawfully are you allowed to do that by law comes to law 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 if if you allow me i think um law becomes law okay. depending on the government in place are you serious that's because the thing is this laws we are talking about we are the same laws that obtains in the 22 years so if we were there and people at that time i i i i felt you know the the this, i said the environment environment has granted me i am confused no me me famani ko wonda halde konde okay okay let me let me let me famani ko wonda halde konde um law becomes law what i said law becomes law depending on who is at the governing uh, that, that's 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 what it is even though it's written but the application makes the law what it it should be That, that we we've seen that happen because there is nothing wrong with the laws there, have, there has not been any changes in the law but we were constrained mr witness we were constrained why don't you why don't you just answer the questions say the on comment i awata rek jaba de lando ko mi hal landi instead of going on the tangent on model modeling the waters just answer ila rawa e lawol ngol anduda ko ndiyan hibba don jabore ko mi landi ma you knew 
you knew fully well that all this was illegal. You knew it. You and yeah, and it yes, you knew it. And you knew it. You knew it. You knew it. You knew it. And you knew it. Yet, yet you decided to go ahead with it. Did it? Fine. Thank you. 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 you decided to keep quiet about the whole thing and as a result you came up with a report which was the basis of the of the prosecution of the accused persons correct? <laughs> Would you respond now? Yes. Hey, counsel. And these people were prosecuted on the basis of your reports. Correct? I think it's on the basis of their statements because the report was just a uh, summary of what was obtained. The, the report is the compendium of all the materials that you have gathered including the evidence so 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 that was the basis of the prosecution is not just their statements but, but what you said makes it even worse they were prosecuted on the basis of statements that you knew were illegally obtained very well, that, that is the content of the report. I'm not saying something outside. You know. The report is a summary of the statement. So that illegality you talk about is the same process. Report on, don't go wrong, go allow, report on, go wrong, go wrong, go wrong, go wrong. I can state there was nothing introduced in that report that is not contained in the file. Nothing. Uh, Even though it was illegally obtained, like we all agreed, but that was the fact. We summarized the statements. And then, and then individual responsibilities was, was and if you have the report you can go to it and see you don't see anything outside what is in the file i, I honestly don't know what you're talking about but, but i'll just go back to my line of questioning you knew that the report or the statements were illegally obtained Correct? Yes, they are obtained under uh, uh, an environment that is not conducive and under jurist. As a police officer, by the Anka uh, police, do you accept or do you believe? That, that people should be prosecuted on the basis of illegally obtained evidence. That should not be fair. And you know that that scheme, the whole arrangement, the way it was structured and the way it was done, it was all aimed at obtaining confessions willy-nilly for in order to produce results that Yaya Jame wanted. That's the truth, isn't it? That's not the way I perceive it. Okay. Who sent in the junglers? How many the junglers have been? Have you idea, Kanzu? I have no idea. Mr. Witness, this is now notorious fact. It is known by everybody that the junglers came from State House. No matter how you pretend, everybody knows. Is it true or false? The junglers came from State House. I came to Nora Lee Moto. Yes, I said, I am no one never got a baby. But you knew that Martin came from State House. And Tigida and the Martin is called State House. Martin was part of the State Guards. You knew Tumbul Tamba came from State House. And you know that Tumbul Tamba called State House or Imoto. 
Yes. He yeah. knew that uh, Musa Jame Malia Mungu came from State House. And he knew Musa Jame alias Malia Mungu ko State, uh, state House or Imotono. Yes, yes Council. Yes, the reason why you were fearful was in fact because you had these so-called characters all from State House overseeing or looking what you guys were doing. Say on a phone, Huli, among other things, be I mean, of the State House, be that of your Hali, couldn't I hold on on for what don't what don't do what don't do. In fact, you knew that those people were sent there to see what you guys were doing, and we are constantly reporting back to your Jame. Isn't that true? Andino, Pekobe, Nila, the English State House, the government, 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 the that they would send GRTS to air the confessions publicly. Is it not true? We could not have any of the GRTS to be able to do what we want to do with the content. Isn't that true? That one is true. Isn't that true? I don't have any. I know GRTS came there because I saw them. But how they came, I don't know. And I don't have any interaction with the GRTS. You don't have GRTS because you don't have any. Not the least. Not a single day that I saw even a staff of GRTS. I don't know. That applies to the GRTS. Doesn't that in fact show that they were sent there by a higher authority? Ndadun holani ni nilo beton enko nilangal koko do imori. I cannot contest that. That may be true. So all this put together just shows that Yajame's presence and his visits loomed large. Oi dunfo holi tere ne Yajame puru andingol yimbe benfo ne kanko imo wodi fo yimbe benfo yidun in the minds of the panelists and dictated what they would do or what they would not do. Unfo wana e hakilaji yimbe be ando da ko benjo ina e on panel puru be fo be anda ko hidi kong. You all knew what you are going to want. Unfo andi no ko hidi no kong. I think to be realistic, this is not about what you are going to want from the start because this is about people wanting to topple him. So obviously whatever happens later if he is interested I, I didn't know about the coming of the GRTS. I, 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 I was, well, not me alone, in fact, most of us were in that room. And can you answer the question asked? All of you knew what Yajame wanted. He wanted confessions by the suspected coupists. Then the under that the nanga no man eko be fala no libu de manja kunda moko on. That may be false. That may be no that we have said because I have never talked to or neither somebody talked to me about what the Ajami said, and I was not in the dealing with these suspects in that light. All right. You agree that the men in black. Did they? Do you agree that they come? They came from state house. Ajami ne pen porni no be in chunchi pale ni ko state house be in me. And these were the people who were beating the suspects. Kope wo no pide be ando da be nanga no ma te be fawa ne be fale libu de la mungu. You answer that. I said I believe so. I am seeking. Alright. And doesn't that show that they were beaten so that they would come and confess to the allegations? Na unholi tiran ne be pia be purio be aru be fala be hala kope fala hal de kong. Kansu I cannot confirm that. I I know that government in the. I cannot confirm that. Well, if that, that instruction was not given to me, and they didn't come to tell me what they were there for, but the, whatever they were doing, if it is instruction for well, me. Well, Mr. Witness, play it how, no matter how you want. Uh, uh, you said these people there. were tortured and brought before you guys, and they made confession. So obviously those tortures would have been mainly to up to extra confessions. Did you, did you agree with that? I have no, I, I cannot disagree with that. Exactly. Exactly. So he sent the soldiers, they came and tortured these people. Those people were brought before you and, and they made confessions. Don't you see that you have done what Yaya Jame wanted? 
I will not see it that way too, uh, still. Mm -hmm. How would you see it? I want to hear about it. Whether I have done what the Ajami wanted, I... I, I yes, by so. recording the confessions. Well, unfortunately, this... I, I, just hear me out. He ensured you guys recorded the confessions. And he sent in GRTS. They broadcasted this confession. As if this, these confessions were genuinely obtained. Isn't that what happened? Well, they were displayed on, on GRTS. Hey, don't go and those confessions were written down by you? By the police. So, don't you see hey. that Yaya Jame has got what he wanted? Probably, I, uh, that, yeah, that's a possibility. You know, but if the line, don't dilute the truth. No, no, what but it is not just a possibility, that, that is a that is that is that is Absolutely. The line of communication we must also do that. Not everybody is privy to talking to Yajami. I have never spoken to Yajami. Did he have to talk to you for you to know exactly what was going on? You were even scared to raise an objection. Were you just scared of men in uniform or were you scared of the authority behind them? It's not the uniform. That's so what was it? It is the authority behind it. And who was the authority? Because the Exactly. Precisely the point. But if you want to look, make it look the way, I would not, I would not be able to answer it that way. But I know that my fears, if I was fearful of anything, it's not the uniform because I'm a uniform officer. I, I, I see uniform yes. so that is not the uniform that, that was intimidating. It was the characters there are with different people who come from different areas. And you never know what they are up to. So that was the cause of concern. Okay. 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 Put it to us. In very, in very, very simple terms. So that a primary three child sitting at home would understand. They too need to know what happened. You guys did what Yaya Jame wanted. Obtain confessions from these people, from these suspects. Yet to go, Congo uh, Bedo. It was broadcast to the whole country. Holama and their leading in four katele. For everybody to believe that this was the truth. Nimbe info purusikane ko holi tira kongo umo ni gonga on. When those confessions were obtained by torture, jurors, intimidation. Yet to go, Nimbe Bedo and do that be two man be ko be fawa no be. Would you agree that that's the truth? The truth council is council. These people were brought and their conditions of appearance suggest they were tortured. And they were interrogated, interviewed. And statements obtained from them. And these statements were summarized. And a report written and sent to the English chambers. Uh, that was the report. Okay, 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 okay. That's what we done. Well, with a witness, you have gone back. You are in the morning, and you sanitized and window dressed the issue. Johnny Allah in a a a a roti ke bao he da fita lavi din pro wawa hebu de kofa lako. You have gone back. You have sanitized and window dressed the issue. A fiti 
apornimo utemo ando dane ko lapintinado let's take it sentence by sentence joni ettiremo koingal ko koingal kongol e kongol they were brought in the adano in circumstances that suggest do alhala mo ando no dane holliteraine they were tortured piano they were brought before us they were interrogated be adano yeso mo landi don be statements taken bindu don kongu di mabbe di these statements were summarized kongu di mabbe di rabbindi nano a report made bindu don report and sent to ag chambers what don na bu don mo ag chambers this is better than photoshop do no no buri photoshop mo yude it's been stripped of all the vestiges of illegality we need to know for it am kala ko ando da ya dane e loi on sedi mo fo itti mo en and package to look nice what do mo packet ha laba that is not what happened wona dum wadi de this my statement is in response to the issue of say ya jammi said this this is what i no, but I, whatever i said is in record Oh, I told you I would say now that can change the well, uh, uh, you just tried you just failed no no I, I, I don't think there uh, uh, is an issue or of or trying or 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 what trials are okay, failed let, okay, okay let's let's dissect it when you send it to them no? they were tortured and brought before you correct that we were the adi obe a town de mada ko dum ha you can show yes you agree with that eh good and and the, they were interviewed in environment that was intimidating te kan de be lando to no be kon dingirama ando no da don no hulbini yes that that bit you skipped in your summary ndon i i when you when the statements were written they were written with the full knowledge by those who were taking the statements that this was illegal ono yettay no be statement ji mabbe de wala kongu di mabbe di onon tigi on andi ne no kongu di di jettira no no woyada ne elaw correct mm -hmm. yes. and when you guys put together to report you knew that this was not an honest report onon tigi de winda no do report about what has happened in those panels and dahi mo yadi elaw in that panel you knew that it was not an honest bona fide report about what has happened wona report mo ando dane mo himo yaadi e lawol no windirdo mo no wona no you agree dan din to the extent that uh, uh, what they said was exactly that was uh, 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 surprise no no. No. no no well if you force me sa force la min to say that this pillar is god and i, I say, say it o pillar ko allah and you submit that report that is what i have said and then a uh, windi dum a uh, anabi a uh, joni tiri yimbe be ando da ko but what you change the character is the fact that i was forced if oh. you omit to say that i was forced the report becomes something completely different sa sa winani nek a forsam pour mi hala dum andi report on yare no yari non be wi ene ko gonga ko min hali ko joni tiri da ka report you see there was this culture of faking reports in the NIA is it got other one no ka NIA ko andu dane on wada on on windai report ji di andu da wona non no di windira no wona non di yari which is used to prosecute people no ko dum don be rewata e gol don on report be ya be nyaawa yimbe be is it that true won dum da dum wona gonga you want me to answer that question yes i did that no i i am not saying that you did mi hala ni ko an wadi i am saying that there was a culture of hard come woni hande ko producing reports that were not 100% truthful woni no ada ena e be ando dane be winda ene report ji di ando dane ya dane e lawol gol ando dane ko no report ji din fonno yaro contain false information kongo di wona di don di fo di ando da haray fo ko fenande wona ta bo it was used as a basis to prosecute people that ko din report di be rewa no be nyaawa yimbe be or the evidence fabricated this was the norm i cannot confirm say they are di ando da no a report on ko dum don be rewa no be nyaawa be yimbe be ando da ko fawa be ko ando da ne ya da ne lawol we are in you i i are in you we are in you prosecuted on the basis of false information ndax ang be nyaawani ma e do report mo andu dane ko ko be fawma ko ha wadani dum
That was not from the NIA. No, 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 no. If there was any false information, and I even wonder what came out of the NIA. Now go. Nah. We report on single word on the NIA. Is that the one you are asking, or general? Because council, you need to be. You have to guide me and guide me right. Because if you are not telling me, what you to confirm. I, I can't no, tell you. you have to guide me right. I can't tell you that I have twenty something years of experience of doing. That is not my issue. So, that so, is not so my so problem. I am guiding you right. right. No, no, no you are not guiding me right. If you want me to, to to attest to statements of have, have the you ever, at the NIA have when you I was ever there? prosecuted a case. So have you ever appeared in court and prosecuted a case? Have you come to that? If that is your Have you ever done so? Na amedi wadelu. Yes. Eh? Which one? Case on the board, I made a new one. It's against me. <laughs> oh my God! It's a mendicant. Can you prosecute a case against yourself? I don't prosecute. At the NIA, we don't have prosecutors. Um, the question was, have you ever prosecuted a case? Oh, yeah. I didn't get so you have zero experience prosecuting a case? Allah experience. You want to tell me how to question or guide witnesses? Let's proceed. Let's proceed. Let's proceed. Let's proceed. Let's proceed. Let's not go into these things. Let's not go into these things. But I will, I, will, I will request that you ask me questions that I have answers for. If no, I, I will not do that. No, no, no. If you are asking me about uh, the NIA uh, making statements or reports that are, uh, when I don't have an idea about that, and you want me to answer, then that me, you are trying to make me look very difficult. Then you are the one who is provoking it. Cancel with your respect. I think you, you, you just... Uh, I, I will just put that aside, please. as if you did not say it. Johnny, may I actually... Johnny, I'll just put it aside as if you did not say What you people did was an illegal fabrication. Except if the curator was fake. It was a creation. The tortures, I know there is no way anybody can justify. But you are here justifying it. I am telling you that what you guys have did can only be described as an illegal fabrication. All of you were complicit in covering up a state-sponsored torture. And you came up with a report with the cover of proprietary when it was all wrong. It was tainted completely by illegality. Do you agree with that? Where the law speaks, I don't disagree. And because of your conduct, before that, I had asked you this question before, that you knew these trials were going on, and none of you had the courage to say that these confessions, which were going to be the basis of these convictions, were illegally obtained. Yeah. Yes, and my response was, you don't, I, I don't have any right to go to any court to, what? to, to, to insist on the And I don't even have the mind. Jabba if if, if there was that possibility, I would not even have the guts to go and do that. Why are you serious? Mr. Witness, you recall you were prosecuted. And you know, why are you doing that? You you were prosecuted. Correct. Yes. Hey. And the person, one of the supposed star witnesses of the prosecution, what happened with him? Can you tell the commission? We be andun mo andun adane ko kanko be darunu pru wona sede e do nyawo remane ko honu wanomo. 
He was arrested uh, and charged for perjury. No, 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 no. I'm not coming to that. Let's come to what happened at the time of your prosecution. We mean me Arani Dundonde, Johnny Wadding, Darod and Kandodak, and then Yawa Remand and Kowan Noko. About what? About his, his testimony? Well, uh, yes, then you say what happened. That's what I answered. This what happened said. during your trial? When you were called as a witness, what they happened? They did not do no money. They testified. They did not do no money. They testified. What did he say? He said he has no idea about what was written in that statement of his. Oh, yeah, Allah, I don't know. But that was his statement. Was his statement? Was his statement? Was his statement? Was his According to him, no. Mr. Witness, he said, we, that he was bribed, be yom no mo, and made to say that statement, pro owa halak ngol don kongol, but the statement was not true. Kongongol wanani gonga. He refused to incriminate you because he does not possess the facts that are contained in the statement. We osali pro ona nama ang sabuna kwono ender ngol kongol vinda ngongol wanano gonga. And that he was bribed by the DPP. We ko DPP o yogu no mo pro owa dum to give the false statement against you. Isn't that what happened? I think you are missing the facts. Before, before all that um, counsel, can you give us a bit of context of this uh, trial? Uh, what happened because it just was, came on and uh, the two of you yes. seem to be the ones <laughs> you know. Uh, well, yes, what happened was he was charged uh, for Abuse of office and abuse of office and uh, uh, and taking money. Yeah, corruption is kind of um, yeah. Is it official corruption? I don't know exactly what the charges are. What? But for taking money from one so-called Christopher Baji, and uh, a star witness was supposed to be a, the person who should come and testify against him. The DPP made arrangements with the witness and got an incriminating statement. The witness came to court and said. I did not make this statement. They tried to bribe me to make this statement. I refused. And he was acquitted. Isn't that what happened? Yes. But the facts I want to correct. Okay, correct the facts. Yes. I, I, the statement, according to him, was written during the time of investigation at the agency. Yes. And he traveled out and he was made to come back. When he came, the DPP called him, according to him, that you, you have, this is a statement, it's the only statement that can put this guy in, 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 in trouble. We will want you to go and testify, and there is a package for you. Nothing was given to him. 250,000? 280,000. All right, there is a package for you. If you testified against this man, then you come and get your money. So he went, he told them, okay, they agree, agree, we went, and after taking the oath, he said what he knew, because he said he would not say true. anything that to incriminate when it was not true. So and didn't he say that the prosecution attempted to bribe him? Okay. So we agree with that. Correct? Yes. Yes. So and the DPP, that's what he told because he was later uh, um, arrested and, and charged for perjury. And, 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 and we were all going to same vehicles, the same mile two together. Then he'd confer with us to say this was what happened. He was offered 280,000 by the DPP, and this was in the office of the DPP, Chenyan, to go and say anything against me. But his conscience would not allow him. Exactly. His what? Say yeah, 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 His what? His conscience. Would not allow him, because he, was, he said he would not take oath and then go and lie. Exactly. That's what he said. Exactly. This is a person who chose, if what he did was true, he chose to act honorably, isn't it? Ko neddo mo andu dane kanko o jabi darade e dow gonga on. So tay ko wadi kon ko gonga o darike e dow gonga. Against all risks against the state. We I kala ko andu dane wodi e hulal ko andu da immoto e dow lamu ngum. This was not a matter of risk against the state. It was. No. This is the man who was going to accuse the DPP of bribery. 
And you were a senior officer who was interdicted at the time. Anko anwo no netlo lamu mo ando dane kan maudo ender lamu munte be fara no ma faude tu mangal ando dawa. The state was prosecuting you. Anko lamu anwo no ma nyaude. Is it? Yeah. What I want? I would still say. Exactly. So so this guy chose to act according to his conscience because he saw what was happening was illegal isn't it kanko o jabi rewde lawol ngol andudane ko ngol don lawol o foti rewde te kadi o yii ne bayri ko neddo mo anduda neddo pewal o jabani ma nanude isn't it that's what he said yes. and you were happy and a well to know I was not sad when I was in my truth. My friend, tell us the truth. You were happy. You were excited. You you were going to be released because of the intervention of this person who chose to act honorably. I think for me, please, my my issue. Just answer the question. No, no, this is not about the reality. Just answer the question. No, I will not answer. You were happy. Not the way you want me to answer. With this one, this is not a matter that is relevant. Even if you choose not to answer, the record would speak for itself. The commission is not a matter for the government. I just want to raise the question whether or not it's even though he the action has to say something like that. But because I was detained for two years. Hold on a second. So the link with the 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 2006 panels is acting honorably by that individual and he so, Mr. Is Chair, what, what I am what? trying to say is I am trying to draw parallels here yeah fine that's okay. the thing I'm looking for uh, somebody he somebody was tasked to do the same violation against him that he had done against others and this guy acted honorably for him leading to his acquittal how did he behave? How did he conduct himself? That's why the that's why the dilly dallying. Now he would well, answer is the question. That I, I don't think <laughs> that's true. this choice of words of yours against me. Sometimes I don't like to. I must say this dilly dallying for what? I was in mile two based on that statement for twenty two months. Okay. For 20 miles. Two, no. some but some people uh, were in mile two for years because you knew and never said any word that the reason why they were in mile two, all those statements were bogus. Yes. And you yes. sat there and kept quiet. You yes. kept mum because you were not the one suffering. And that is how it feels, Mr. Witness. That, that, is, that is true, Kansu. Exactly. So let's leave it at that and then we move on. Yeah, okay, but <laughs> you ought to have and should have acted honorably by showing that the basis of the detention, the incarceration of these people and sentenced to death, sentenced to life, sentenced to 25 years was because we, because people like you refused to do what the law required you to do. Tapi begin before, tapi begitu untuk besok ini begin dua puluh empat begin info begin dua puluh naga saya jual begin before tu begin warde. Kawan orang beranda dana orang wadani lagi monde orang monkey wadai lagi monde no luar orang haliri mono. That is what happened. Kau dengar itu. Do you regret it? Nda anim si itu. There are regrets over this. Yes. Do you regret it? Do you regret what you guys have done? I've regretted what had happened to all these people. And I, I, as far as don't I dilute the answer. Just answer me specifically on this particular issue. The work of the panel. This work you said you are not proud of. Do you regret what you yes, guys have yes, done? Yes. 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 Thank you very much. That's the honorable thing to do. What would you say to those people who were sentenced to life imprisonment or sentenced to death, sentenced to 25 years or God knows how many years imprisonment? By reason of these bogus reports you guys have produced, what would you say to them? Well, I, I will tell them it's regrettable that what had happened to them. Particularly in terms of their tortures and all that stuff, I, I feel very saddened. I mean, uh, my own side of my conduct, I request kind of forgiveness from them.
I have no further questions. Mi ala hai goto landal ngal mi lando to makadi. Thank you very much, Mr. Counsel, and thank you again, Mr. Madam Basau, for your testimony. Kya manvi ajara ma Counsel, ajara ma Mr. Dembazo, esedi agal mangal. Commissioners, if you have any questions to ask, please indicate. Jo lini mo landa re Commissioner be kala jogi do landi pur landa kol se de o hina wai holder de. If there are no questions, Mr. Basau, if you have. Oh. You didn't indicate to Commissioner. Go ahead and do so now. Witness. You said, you sat there and you are helping the victims who have been tortured to 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 speak the truth. We da angajodi no don pro walla be be anduda be phoneo be pro be fala libu de lamo wano do do on pro wawa be walu de be hala gona. How can they speak the truth when you know they have been beaten mercilessly? We hono be hala ita gona te anga andi ne be kopia be ha be fala be jogori maile. And you are fully aware. Anti gia andi. And you are fully aware that. Anti gida andi dunne. It's because they have refused to say what the people want them to say. Andi ne bi ko ko tay dum ko esali hal de ko andu da ko dum yimbe ben fala no be hala ono yimbe won no be don be. Not necessarily the truth. Wona gonga on. Isn't that so? Wona dum won no. I think chairman, I would I would want to withdraw this word help. You say ki chairman the fact that you angled or kungol where I put it. Because it will suggest that I I I am I'm condoning a certain. So, unfortunately, what I had wanted to convey is there was a need for us to come up with a report, and that report can only be informed by recording their statements. So, that was report of another one. Meaning, some of them, but as as based on that report, they were even recorded to be to be used in a different way or even released. Possibly, the 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 word help has given another meaning to what I had wanted to say. That was not meant to justify. What happened at the commission was at the panel was right. And this was a report based on uh, um, uh, statements uh, that were coerced. Yes. Extorted, <laughs> as the DG of NIA would say. Yes, indeed. <laughs> See, I don't have any problems with you using synonyms in this <laughs> tense. Um, anyway, um, any more uh, questions now? Uh, Mr. So, you may proceed now to make your concluding remarks if you have any. <coughs> Thank you, Chairman and Mr. Sir, Alhamdulillah. For Chairman Ajarama, Johnny Minam Palawi, the Alhamdulillah, sitting before this honourable house. Jada Gol, a do o ndu sudu, a yes ndu imbe ndu sudu, ndu da imbe benfo no wadi mahorma. Given the opportunity to see what I know about the 2006 foil coup investigations. Puru mi joni tira komi andi kong e koyari e do 2006 kudeta mo anduda o o fala no wadde do kono Allah wali o wadani. I wish to state that mi fala hal de dunne. Whatever happened during that time, ender undong e o don waktu. As far as our um, panel was concerned, Kalako ando da panel amen on wadi no dum on tuma. Had um, a lot of things to do with um, the circumstances that was at stake. No, we wadi no mo foko ando da kono alhali on panel on no wani no 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 be darni no mo no ko dum tahi dum yari no. What had been meted? So the suspect could not be just uh, be justified by any other person. Oi, kala ko wada no be don be ando da be fawi no be umgal don jamfa jamfa yaro do edo la mungung hai goto wa wata no mo ando chule. And I feel sad and very remorseful. Oi, te mi nimsi dun te kadi dun ko iwana ni la yurme de emete berne. To be associated with things like this. Oi, puru be wa wa India am nane e yim be be ando da ko be mo wadi dun wadu. For those who know me. Yimbe andu belambe can attest to you to to you as to me why hal disasoming. 
unfortunately we kono ko ando dane bayri yari no the system we had at the time o yi on tuma lamungu no wonir no no was really uh, a bit of a problem o yi ko dum wonno a problem o that who in most cases would hesitate o yi ender labi bui yi ando dane bi be yettay bi kono yarata no falira da no to see what new feelings ah wawata halde ko andudane ko dum mijida and this to an extent had warranted a number of gambians live in the source of the gambia we dum wadi ha yimbe hewbe gambian be acciti gambia be hi be hodo yi nokugo for fear of whatever the thing could have happened to them gol ko andudane ko wawa so be jodi ke do dum no wawi be hebude and the never again we all never again mo ti arasi holi to me is very important we dum no hebi faida Gambia is our homeland. We Gambia and in Kodo woni lady men and we are all duty bound to protect the, in, the interest and integrity of the country. Enen fo dum ko ware fe men pour wawe darade habode ko anduda ne no fala adude bonere e der Gambia. The security of Gambia we komi ayno gol Gambia. It's a matter for all of us. We ko enen fo foti darade wada. What I have noticed we kono komi yi is that actively or passively we come yimbe be anduda hibe hen wala be ala hen what had happened in the last 22 years we ko wadi ko en der dubi nogasi e didi yawtu didi had been uh, a collective responsibility in my view we kan ko no yiri dum ko yimbe ben fo wadi for all those gambians we gambian be ben fo of the age of 18 and above we kala wondo du hebudo dubi sappo e jetati e dow unfortunately we dum bayri ko no yari um gambia we all know it to be a smiling coast naturally that is the truth for and the gambia ko lady jam so it to turn to be something else different we pour dum wawa waylita de wona goddum go ko anduda ne wona ko andira no ko if not for the hesitation of people we so to ano yimbe ben ko be jodoto ko no ndaray piji di anduda no wadate fota wadde di to point out the facts we pour hollitira ko woni yade ko gonga on yi maybe you could not have gotten this far wawa yarata no ni as a security officer we can go uh, uh, ligoto on lamu mo ando dane ko gayna ko lamu and as somebody who forms part of the core management of the gambia police force we can go kadi himo tawa e himbe be ando dane ko ben na we wallata gambia police force no yarata yeso no we are inclined to uh, uh, reforms we hi be okka hi be foti rewde lawol gol and ki among what we are doing we ko won be woni wadde ko joni is to ensure we pour wawa holliterde officers are capacitized we ligoto be ben haray be hebi knowledgeable in areas ma maaji di anduda hi be hebi kadi gandal di anduda that forms the basics of investigations we ko dum don wawa ta be wallude pour so hunde wadi be wawa andirde no dum yaari ni in ensuring that people's rights are protected we pour dum don wawa ne pour so be dabbutude di don ko be fala andude ko e yimbe ben tawa be bonnani wara because without without compromising security oy dum non kadi tawa ar ar gol yimbe ben kadi no tawa he mudum so the leadership as we speak at the gambia police force oy joni lawol gol be rewata gol pour wawa yide yeso yaga gal e gambia police force is bent on ensuring that oy ko dum don ko din labi be woni rewde we have the right where we tell come have the right where we tell the right logistical support so we be windi kadi labi di anduda di anda be wawa di rewde pour yimbe be anduda be ligoto ton be heba yimbe be anduda ko ben foti wonde ton to do our job pour be wawa wadde ligge mabbe den no yaa however as as a matter of concern we joni dum do fo ko yide yimbe ben some of the rights we labi di anduda ko dum be woni rewde di uh need some uh, um, amenities particularly the infrastructural support ni be ni be be yidi bagasi jidi anduda ne ko way ni wa batimaji di anduda be way ni gade edin i'm saying this because if you want to uh, somebody commits a crime and he's supposed to be detained and he's a juvenile or a woman o wi so tay neddo wadi ko anduda yada ne e luwa be foto mon nango de be joddina you go to stations across the country sai kan de ka lady ndim fo you will 
realize that the police force is concerned in some aspects. And since it's a demand mm. and a constitutional re re responsibility that we protect people's rights. What if my ando dane lamu on no forty mo walu de police army? I think it's important. We do not know heavy fighter that we all put hands together. We end in four war and join in the jungle to support. The reform structures, the reform activities. I also want to encourage Gambians to be law abiding. I respect the, 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 the happenings within the, uh, the TRRC. But I would so, I also request that some little bit of hesitation be given in areas. I, I will say this for the fact that there was a pronouncement that was made here of course for good reasons. And by coincidence we my team of investigators had to conduct an arrest somewhere. And this is a cognizable crime. It's a failure crime that is arrestable. We don't The son to the suspect. confronted Confronted. The police, a police being, asking for a warrant of arrest. Some of these things are becoming challenges and it will have some national security implications. So that's, that's why I want Gambians, Gambians and non-Gambians in the Gambia, to try to be law-abiding in the interest of reform and in, in getting the proper environment within the entire country. That said, Mr. Chairman, I wish to thank you and your entire commission members and the lead council and his team for at least doing justice to this nation. Uh, in the law. I know it's a daunting tax, but it's we good. And I wish to also thank my entire family for supporting me in all aspects. Although Mr. Fall didn't um, ask me to narrate my ordeal, but I respect that because for me, I, I took that as a challenge and a test on my feet by the Almighty Allah. Even though I didn't say anything, we didn't say anything about it. But I'm saying to those that had contributed in one way or the other in, in seeing me there, I have, I have nothing against him and I've forgiven everybody. I have forgiven everybody. The commissioner and the commission don't know the details. We commission on and no yari to. But I would want to make it clear to the entire Gambian people that I owe no grudges against anybody as far as my individual ordeal was concerned. We I was in mile two for twenty months. We more no mile to in Lebinogas. Um, 18 of which were uh, without a warrant. We uh, and I was going to court until at the final end I was uh, discharged. We discharge. But I don't hold anything against anybody, and I forgive. must have a rule in one way or the other. 
With these remarks, Mr. Chairman, I want to thank you. Oh, Mr. Yeah. Chairman, a do di do kungu di minanjar na makadi. Yes, Mr. Chair, I think it behoves me to set the record straight with regards to with regards to uh, the witnesses' victimization. In his statement, he says he does not want to do talk about it. He is just providing the information because he was asked. That's one reason. So I thought he wanted some little bit of privacy about that. The other issue is the violation. What I have seen on paper was not one violation, one type violation the TRRC is interested in. An allegation was made against him. On that basis, he was interdicted. On that basis, he was arrested, and detained, and prosecuted, and he was acquitted. According to him, his letter to Yaya Jame, he said, he thanks the president for creating the environment for rule of law to happen in this country. We have nothing against that. Our problem is that same Yaya Jame did not allow rule of law to happen against other people. And that's what we focused on. So he has no complaint. I did not know that he was detained in mile two for two years without warrant. Uh, uh, or 20 months without a warrant. I would be surprised how anyone would get into remand without a warrant. But if we did know that, certainly that is a matter that the Commission would be interested in. And this is the reason why we have to do these things, so that we can put, we can have a country in which rule of law would be taken for granted and not used just as a matter to extol the leadership knowing full well that it is just pure talk and not supported by any facts. Thank you. And there was the 20 months of detention at mile two after your participation in the um, panel. We take Lebinogas the Anduda Benangi no Mabe Teguma mile two. So they put in the in a you know don't a own panel. They don't yaw to court go on what? Yes, Chairman. Yes, it was from 20, uh, 2008 September to 2010 May. Um, we could get a September to 2010 May. And the other panel members, did they but also go to jail? Some of them would consult me when they had uh, those problems of going to the NI here and there. Sometimes they would come and say, Police give uh, Then we confer. We, we had established a very, very good relationship. Now, what I'm after hmm? is some. Uh, going to mile two after fabricating reports that went to the AG on the basis of which um, convictions some um, were made. Yes, it is uh, after that. It was after that? It was after that. And the other panelists, um, what happened to them? Did no. they also go to jail like you? No. Some did. Some did. Mysterious but ways that God's act. Karma. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, uh, Mr. Dembeso, very much um, uh, for your testimony. And uh, we will meet again tomorrow morning. Mr. Dembeso, Congo Division is at Katiara. Meeting is adjourned.